Hey guys, it's me. Okay, so we have a new snack to try. Here it is. These are chocolate churros. And they are from Korea. Mmm. Okay, so right off the bat, I can tell you these smell really, really good. They smell just like real churros. They smell so good. Well, how they smell. So they're mini. They're mini little bite-sized churros. Let's try these, shall we? Mm. So honestly, guys, incredible. They honest to God taste like churros. Like a crunchier version of a churro. Like if you could imagine what a cereal would taste like, like a churro cereal, this is it. Mm. Incredible, guys. I swear. We need to step up our game in America. Mm. They're so good. Before I go, I real quickly want to remind you all to please check out my blog at thebookofrue.com. I did a article and a vlog. It's kind of a blog and a vlog together. That's a tongue twister for you. What I basically spoke about was disabilities, of course, but also I talked a little bit about why on here I call myself the two-foot crippled lady. A lot of people keep asking me why I do that. Why I call myself the two-foot crippled lady. Why don't I use a nicer word? Why don't I just say the two-foot lady? Or um, some people said, why don't I put the two-foot beautiful lady or the two-foot unique lady and blah 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 well those are great suggestions but i'm gonna keep it as the two-foot cripple lady and here's why the reality is i am crippled that's the reality i'm crippled it's not a bad thing it's just the reality of my situation so we need to change our outlook on that word. The word is not a bad word. It's our outlook on the word. So anyways, I explain it all in the blog. So check it out, guys. God bless. Love you. Bye. Oh, delicious. <laughs> Bye, guys.